morning, people of the Philippines. I'm Jory Gregor for TV 12 News Alert. Pressure area embedded along the intertropical convergence zone, and after it enters the Philippine area of responsibility, it is called now Typhoon Nandine, the 14th typhoon that enters in the Philippines this year. And based on available data at 250 kilometer east of north east of Guan Eastern Samar. Let's see the update from Kimberly. Kimberly, what's the situation there? We are here in Maritima City, inside the Metro Manila. We are experiencing light to moderate rain due to the high heat region and low pressure area and thunderstorm moderate rain coming from the north east to south east. But you can see now in the background, the floods are returning to height. And that's all for now. Wait for the update. For their update, I am Kimberly Garcia reporting. This is the report from Visayas. In part of Visayas, the Colomar is now experiencing moderating rainfall. It is due to the ITCC and low pressure. I just going to the main typhoon Nandi. After it entered the park, the winds blowing from the southeast to southwest of Palawan. Visaya is the eye of Typhoon Nandi. It is to Zamboanga Peninsula in Mindanao. For the report, Sayan Galuta. The report from Mindanao, Joyce Ann Tapid. That's the latest update of Pagasa. Again, you got it for TV 12 News Alert.